Hey guys, so we are at Sturgeon Falls KOA. We're just finishing packing up from a two night stay here. Um, from here, we are going north of Sault Ste. Marie to Blueberry Hill Campground, I believe it's called. So it's a long drive. It's about four hours and 50 minutes. So good luck with the little ones. Um, our stay here has been nice. I don't know if it's a new thing for COVID or if they've always done it, but they are sending text messages, the KOA here to, to you. So when we were leaving, they sent one saying, we know you're coming here, safe travels. And then once we were checked in, we got a text message about being checked in and that they deliver pizza if you wanna order pizza um, and to text them if you need wood or anything like that. So we did actually end up ordering pizza the first night. Just, it was hot, did not feel like cooking. So we got some pizza, it's pretty good. Um, we also paid for the Wi-Fi, so the high speed Wi-Fi. It's not bad if you're in an area that it reaches, but the sites we're at, I believe it's 21 and 23, um, the Wi-Fi doesn't reach the greatest, so it works, but you have to be in a different site than these sites. It wasn't the greatest in these sites. Um, we also went to the beach, uh, the water, the top, the layer, top layer, beautifully warm. The rest is a little cool, but it's nice, uh, since it was so hot this weekend. We did go down the slide that they have there. That was fun, uh, and played in the sand a little bit and made some sand castles. The, the rest of the amenities are open now here, like the playground, they have a volleyball net, badminton net, all that was open. We didn't end up playing any, at any of it, just too hot to do that. Um, the staff, extremely friendly. It was different than the first time we were here, as the first time there was only a few campers. This time it's completely, completely full. There's just trailers coming in and out constantly, so that's good for them. And like I said, the staff are still friendly, even though they're busy, so that's awesome. Um, the only thing is depending where you are in the park like our sites there are no trees So it's hot in the Sun and because the way that they're angled our trailer pretty much had Sun on it on the front where the awning would be All day even with the awning. There's such little shade So we were spent the most of the time at my mom and stepdad's because the way the Sun was again. They were Opposite of us. So they got a little bit more shade But yeah, other than that the campground is still beautiful. It's nice to see that it's so full um, the water was great and that's our, our journey so far. I'm not going to do another tour of the campground just because I already have a video posted of that. So if you do want to recap on that, you can go back to that video and see the campground itself. Um, but other than that, stay tuned for our journey and see how our drive went.